Hello, Defense Attorney Mark Rosenfeld here. I wanted to talk for a minute about the Department of Motor Vehicles and physical and mental reevaluations. This is a subject I've talked about before, but it seems to be becoming more and more prevalent. I just finished handling a case for a client who was involved in a minor accident. He's about 65 years old, and when the police arrived, they decided that there was an issue with my client's ability to drive, and they filed paperwork with the Department of Motor Vehicles. The paperwork was not accurate or not reliable, and we ended up having to conduct a hearing at the DMV. The police officers indicated in their paperwork that my client was driving on the wrong side of the road, he was driving on the sidewalk, and he was involved in an accident, and then he had no recollection of the events. This is what was submitted to the DMV, and based on these reports, the DMV immediately suspended the license. We went into action, we demanded a hearing, and then we needed to show the DMV that what was submitted by the police department was not accurate, was not trustworthy, and was not reliable. So we worked on our end with our client and his doctor, as well as looking at the traffic collision uh, information, the traffic accident information, the police report documentation, and we conducted a hearing with the Department of Motor Vehicles and showed them where the paperwork submitted by the officer was inaccurate, incorrect, and incomplete. We then were able to submit documentation from our client's physician that there was nothing affecting his ability to drive and ultimately we guided our client through a series of questions, a direct examination and cross-examination with the DMV hearing officer, ultimately showing the hearing officer that this was a minor accident that had nothing to do with any mental or physical disabilities. In the end, the DMV uh, agreed with us, returned the driver's license to our client, and he is able to get back to work and continue to drive. These hearings can move very quickly. Sometimes they move slowly and we need to move them faster. It's important that you have an attorney who is experienced with the Department of Motor Vehicles and physical and mental reevaluations and the different types of PNM hearings. If you've got questions about the DMV, and a license suspension, I'm always happy to talk. I handle cases in Southern California, and you can reach me directly at 310-424-3145. Be safe, take care, give me a call with any questions.